Hey guys, it's Kami and today I'll walk through the latest update. Witch Awakening on 26th of October. Now let's move to the Halloween event. The quest part of this event is starting today, the other two parts will start tomorrow. All of them will run till 9th of November and event items will be deleted on 16th of November. The quest part of it consists of two quests. Actually there are more Halloween related quests, but more on that later. So those quests are for level 16 and 20 or higher. NPCs you can see on your screen. And as a quest reward you will get Halloween helmet slot costumes, which you can also see on your screen. The second part of this event is the usual luck rolling box containing all sort of things inside. Some of those you can see on your screen. In order to get that Halloween gift box you will need to combine Halloween cookie and Halloween candy basket together in a shape of minus. You can obtain Halloween cookie from the challenge simply by playing 2 hours per day. If that wasn't obvious, you can get up to 1 cookie each day. Candy basket you can get from Lara in Heidel, also on a daily basis. She will give you a quest. From the description of this quest I can tell you that you will need to deliver her Halloween candy, which is the third part of Halloween event. I can't show it to you right now, because this quest and challenge will start tomorrow. Though by the time this video will be up, it will be already available for you. And so the last part, candies will drop from mobs all over the map. It can restore one energy and is also used to finish Lara quest. Note that they will be removed during maintenance on 16th of November. Now let's move to the changes. Death count of mounts will no longer increase in the node and castle war locations during the actual war in progress. In order to celebrate this change, games have reset death counts of all mounts. Now death count of my main horse went from 1 to 0. You can now reset death count of camels with the very same cash shop item. Now you can summon up to 5 pets. If you didn't know, previously it was 4. And by the way, it still says so in the actual description. Probably they just forgot it and it is basically the time to get the fifth pet. And since their unique skills now stack, you can increase your cat army by one more. Halloween related loading screen, objects in the world and so on and so forth. Added new premium female hairstyles. I would show you all of them, but I forgot which ones were old, so I have no idea which ones are new. If I got it correctly, they fixed a rare bug with the blade not being drawn out of sheath in the combat state of blader and plum. This was an extremely old bug, it was there since I started to play. Now you cannot sell furniture that are sold by NPCs on the market. And finally, as usual, price changes. Cash shop items, lots of them.
And that's about it for this video. Thanks for watching and I'll see you next time.